Oh, it's getting breezy out there now. Hang on a minute. Whoa. That was this morning. And as you can see from the skies, the weather here in the UK rubbish. It's not been very good for a, a, more than a week really. So what was I doing up at a stupid o'clock in the morning? Well, the sky was clear for a little bit. I had a window of about half an hour where the only clouds that were around were really high clouds. So I went down to the beach, took my DSLR, put it on my Omegan clockwork mount, decided to see what I could get at the core of the Milky Way. Even with high clouds, it sometimes is possible to get an image. I took these with my mobile phone, just to show how bad the sky was this morning. Sometimes it's not practical to wait around for perfect conditions when you live in a country like this, with weather like this. Sometimes you just have to go with what you've got and do the best that you can. Even when the clouds are scudding overhead like this and making the skies really difficult. So I took my DSLR, put in an astronomic clip-in light pollution filter, used my Omegan LX2 mini track clockwork mount and took a series of 30 second images to see what I could get. Sometimes you can do something even if the skies aren't perfect. In fact the skies were pretty awful early this morning. But sometimes you can just about get something out of it if you do some processing and take some time and care in setting up your camera when you take your images. A tracking mount and a clip-in filter that blocks out a lot of the light pollution can really help. So let's go back and see how it went. Oh, I always see clouds would go. I hate clouds. It was too windy for me to record on video what I was doing. I was in a hurry to capture as much as I could in the breaks in between the clouds while I had a chance. By cranking up the ISO, I managed to capture about nine images in between the breaks in the clouds. I shot about 50, but only nine of them were clear enough to use. Oh, it's getting breezy out there now. Well, it's quarter past four. It's now astronomical twilight. Start of another day. So I took my DSLR, I had a 50 millimeter lens, out onto the beach at half past three in the morning like a madman. So I'm back in my car and we'll see what results we get when I get them back to the computer. I have to admit the Omegan LX2 mini track mount for a clockwork mount is just fantastic. You get out there, you set up quick, and you start taking images quick. I love it for that. So, hopefully, fingers crossed, we've got something. I had to stand by my camera and act as a windbreak for most of it. <sighs> oh well, driving home now. Okay, let's stack these images in sequitur and get them ready for processing. After stacking with sequitur, 
and an hour and a half processing in Photoshop. It's amazing how much data you can pull out. This is the final result.